money on the third day of Christmas. My baby gave to me a certificate to get my favorite CDs. On the second day of Christmas, my baby gave to me the keys to a CLK Mercedes. On the first day of Christmas, my baby gave to me quality T I M E. All right, guys, so I ordered my first plant online. I didn't even realize till I got into plants that it was possible to actually order online. So this is called the snake plant, Centervia, Centeria. It'll be in the description, <laughs> the name of this plant. Um, I haven't opened it. UPS just brought it. And it took about um, a little less than a week for it to come. And it was $31. You're not going to see my face because I'm getting ready to unbox it and I want you guys to see it. So it was 30 It ended up being $31 with tax. And it was 20 I think it was $27.99 or something like that. And there's another plant that I like. It's called Fiddle Leaf Plant or Fig Leaf Plant. It has like the big elephant ear looking um, leaves on it. Um, this one is one that I know that they say it's like hard to kill and I've been killing plants and I've been trying so I said you know what let me try to get one that is a little bit bigger because I know these plants are good but they also take forever to grow and I wanted something that's already big because I needed something in the corner of my room so I'm going to open this with you guys and see if I got a good one the reviews were okay um it was I, I can say it seemed like it was more good than bad but at the end of the day um i guess it's just trial and error to see what works for you right off the rip i see one that is damaged which is the tallest one this plant is supposed to be anywhere between two to three feet and i see one stem that's way up here you guys can see that i don't know if y'all can see it there's one stem that's like way up at the top right there so it looks healthy so far. I guess I can pull it out this way. This is my first plant online purchase. So I hope it's healthy and it, it was worth it. So you guys can see where my hip is and how high this is so far let me cut this stuff off yeah i i wanted to do baby plants but they just take long and i just want that look of a big full-grown plant um because these take a while to grow they really do it's cold it's packaged pretty okay so far <clears throat> trying to make sure i keep it in the camera for you guys let me see if i can Oh, good thing I look because I almost cut a leaf right here. Y'all see that? So let's see. There. Uh, uh, the dirt is all over the place. I see that. I don't like that. Comes with called snake plant and it's sin severia it's it's a long word let me see if i can show it to you guys that's the actual word of the plant but it's known as the snake plant and it's a light it could be high light medium light or low light that's what i like about it low water needs like some people say their water theirs once every two weeks some people say they water water theirs once a month um fertilize in spring and summer special features super easy to grow purifies the air that's really why i wanted it because of rizzi and my husband's allergies so i wanted to start getting more of these in my house um let's see let's see let me bring you guys down So far, it don't look bad. I know it has to get acclimated to my home. So let me cut, let me get this off. 
Let me see. I think they got like a regular pot. The other one was a little higher and it was like um, a different pot, but I'm not about to pay $10 more and I have my own pots, but it looks like they got two pots. Like they give you a decent little pot. Let me see. It looks pretty healthy. I guess I can't really complain. Um, you know, I'm picky about the way my leaves look and all that stuff. And so I really like to pick my own plants out. But when I seen the reviews and how some people were saying that they were pretty cool with um, sending out good ones, some people in certain areas didn't get good plants. The plants were like tore up and messed up when they came to them. So um, they were upset about that. And I would be too. But actually, that's the same plant pot that they were trying to give in that one that was $10 more. Because as you guys can see, it's two pots. Let me see if I can pick this up. It's kind of heavy. It's actually in a pot. It's actually in a nice pot. And then there's the growing pot inside that pot. If y'all can see that. So yeah, I'm going to leave her right in here. And they say you're supposed to let her get acclimated to your home, the temperature and everything for um, some weeks before you even repot it. So I'm not going to touch it. I'm just going to kind of smooth this out because I don't want this falling on my carpet in my bedroom. And wipe these leaves off, get all the stuff off of them. But that is my unboxing of my snake plant. And some of the leaves are damaged, but it's not something that I can't deal with. Um, hopefully she'll spread out, or I might have to spread her out. Um, it looks pretty healthy to me. What do you think? You plant lovers, people who have plants, what do you think? Does she look healthy to you? I wanted this to be one video, but maybe I can pick her up. I think they put too much soil. I can see baby plants coming in. You can see the little baby. See this little baby plant coming in right here? Um, do I see any more babies? I can't really tell because the soil was like all up in between the actual plant. But that's what it looks like. I think it looks pretty healthy. Do you guys think the same? Plant lovers, let me know something. Tell me some plant tricks, tips. If you have this plant, if you love it, why do you love it? How do you water yours? Just let me know. I wanted to unbox that with you guys because you know I'm on a journey to try to get away from faux plants because I like faux plants and I find some really nice faux plants where people think they're real. But I really want to have these type of plants that are real in my home to clear and purify my air for my baby and my husband. Well, all of us, it's good for everybody to have good oxygen in their home with natural plants. So if you have any tips or um, tricks for me for this plant, just let me know. But I think that if I did want to get another plant, I will be ordering with them because it's not bad. I mean, it's one got a little um, clip off right here. Then this one, I mean, I guess because it was so big, the tip is like broke off. But I'm probably going to just take that right on off. And yeah, other than that, I think it looks healthy. What do you guys think? Um, thank you guys for joining me in my plant unboxing. And I will be sure to make sure I put the name um, on the... It will be in the title or in the description of this actual plant. All right. Later, Gator. See you guys. Happy holidays, my revivers. This is where I am on social media. I hope you are enjoying the 25 days of us, Miss. You are going to get a video every day, whether it be a live, a vlog, or a DIY. Make sure those notifications are on. Share the channel. And guess what? I'll see you tomorrow.